Evening folks, right here's another little project that I've just finished and I will talk you through it. I did try to do a video but for some reason my videos are not loading properly and I'm not going to be doing them over and over again. Um, so here it is, here's a little picture frack, a picture frack, a little picture plaque um, and I've used this, I can't remember where I got them from, the, uh, the coat hangers. Um, and I've just written in there my grandchildren um, and what it was was a little frame, a little wooden frame and I used the ferro in the blackberry for the frame but what I did first of all I used a coat of clear gesso on the front of the uh, frame I then coated it with this ferro and I dabbled it, you know, stippled it, just using a paintbrush, plenty on the brush, stippled it all over because it dries pretty quick. And then I used um, some of these like little glass crystals on it while it was wet. I just sprinkled them on and I only did the top, the right hand side and half across the bottom because no point in wasting it when you're going to put flowers on it as well. Um, then when I finished that, I remembered I had, I thought I need a little pattern or something to it and I remembered I had some of this, do you remember it was the non-stick mat that you can use in your kitchen to stop your decks from burning when you're using hot pans. So what I did, I laid it across the frame, used the um, gold metallic paint and just dabbled it on with the finger sponge um, and I did it all over that part of the frame and then when I finished it I thought oh well I might as well just stick a bit of it on it anyway so I cut a little bit off and just glued that on and it has glued quite well uh, just for decoration basically and to add a little bit of flair to it um, and then what I did is I found this peacock feather because I love peacock feathers I used one of the metal um, ooh, just noticed that I've bent that let me bend that back sorry Oh, that's it. Somehow I bent that. In that one. Never mind. Bent back. Um. So I used uh, the peacock feather. Like I said there. Then I used one of the metal embellishments here and stuck the main rows on. And then I used the little flowers here in the plum colour. So it's all colour coordinated. And uh, and then put the coat hanger on. And I do like that just something different so you can see, I'm not sure if you can see it up close oops that way you see the gold the little gold squares where I've dabbled st stippled it on and then like I say cut a piece off and stuck it on there and uh, I'm quite pleased with that this was a picture of my grandchildren and, and this was my eldest one who was actually she was laid on top of him but because it was a little square frame I cut it off uh, cut him out and just put him there but um, yeah, I like that. My grandchildren. They all laid on top of each other. And um, there you go. And then hung it on their coat hanger. And I like that. Should have put the date in there, really. I might change that and put the date in it. So, um, just thought I'll share that with you. Um, like I say, it's just trying different effects. Um, different ways of... Um, titivating up your, <laughs> your prop don't start me laughing it's just a word we use just it's just different ways to show you how to use the equipment that you have um, you know we all have a lot of crafting uh, well not everybody does but obviously but many of us have uh, quite a bit of uh, crafting material that we never ever use and I'm not one of those that can sit here and have it sat in the drawer without being used I just don't see the point I don't buy it because I want it to look, make my room look good. I buy it to use it, and that's exactly what I do. So, you know, whether it's odd or it, like this, you know, I'd class that as being odd, but to me, it's art. And um, so, just have a go. I'm really disappointed with my, and I must get another one. So it's terrible, isn't it? <laughs> but like I say. 
things I like. I always use things I like. And there you go. So now I've got a little hanging plaque. And I'm quite pleased with that. But get you look into your, look in your drawers and your tubs and everything and fish things out and just think, use your imagination. Think outside the box and you'll be surprised at what you can come up with. You know, be different. So I hope you like that. I do. Thanks for watching. Mm-hmm.